um, hi there. This video is on behalf of someone called Chris Brown. Okay, um, you went to my country lately in Africa, and um, you people fought to get you there because uh, the youth of my country loves you. They wanted to see you. Uh, many people saved money just to go to the concert, you know, that you should have done, but you didn't do. They saved money. You don't know how much it costs for people to be able to pay for the, for the ticket to go and see you. you. You don't even realize. This is not USA, man. You are in Africa, okay? First, you asked first to have a plane with a... Uh, with a bed. If the blade didn't have a bed, they, you, you wouldn't come. So, the biggest, one of the biggest music award of Africa have to be uh, rescheduled, rescheduled for you. And most of the artists that had to go there got upset, didn't go. And they pay an extra $100,000 almost to rent a jet to send it to USA to pick you up, you were inside, you came back, you came to Ivory Coast that, uh, at about 5 a.m. People were there to receive you. We put you in one of the best hotel, hotel of the country, one of the most, you know, the, one of the biggest hotels in West Africa. You were inside in Ivory Coast. You didn't pay anything. They looked after you. You had to do a concert for peace in Africa but you didn't do it you don't know you, you, you think it's all about the money and the fame man it has nothing to do with that you, you know sometimes yourself you should think about people not only money and things when you were singing you were i could see you say fuck and touching your sweat and think like you know feeling disgusted to be there man you know you took all that money you didn't make the concerts you know you 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 reach more you already rich man you already have the money why would you take the money of the poor African I mean how do you feel about that are you alright are you happy with that man this should have been a very nice experience for you man you came back to your roots you got no brain man you know you got no brain you are a little stupid kid that's all you are and and seriously all the people that love you man I'm sorry for them because. You know, I'm going to tell you something that you don't know, mate. Michael Jackson went to the same country where you were and was in the same place where you were, okay? And he was happy. And Michael Jackson is 60 times you, man. He's, he's, he will never be as big as Michael Jackson, right? But when he came to my country, he respected her and I, uh, us. He respected everybody. And I'm going to tell you something, man. Michael Jackson sung, sung in my country without taking any money, okay? That was how big this guy was, okay? And I'm gonna tell you something also. Michael Jackson performed in the streets. He didn't perform in the place where you perform. He performed in the streets. You can Google it. Michael, Michael Jackson in Ivory Coast. And you're gonna see he was dancing out outdoor, man. Okay? He respected her, man. He took himself same as us. He was sweaty. He was sick. You know, Michael Jackson, everybody knows he's sick. He was very fragile. But he did it for the people that move that I wanted to see him, that were happy. And he didn't stop only in Ivory Coast. He went pretty much all over all the places he could go through. Chris Brown, you are a piece of shit. Okay? You are a piece of shit. You and your bitch Rihanna, you are two pieces of shit. Because uh, behind the big man, they, they say there were always a big woman. And if she was a big woman, she would have tell you to fucking do what your contract say. Okay? But because you got no brain, you are a stupid motherfucker, so you didn't do it. And I'm gonna tell you something. All the money you took there, I hope that money kill you. Okay? I hope that money is gonna kill you. I hope you're gonna get use drug wheel on your bitch and die with it. Because you took money of really, really poor people. Okay? You took money of poor people. You didn't perform and you took off. You are a son of bitch. That's all I can say. Stick it in your ass.